What what door? I need. I may need to hit the unlock button. We'll take care of that. Step please here, clear please. this. Sorry. Please step up here. Please. Okay, but please clear this. I've not done anything wrong. We never said you did. And the dog may have just done some type type of a false alert. Well, I mean, it's not a false alert. I can't explain to you. The dog hits on the odor of narcotics. That's not a hundred percent say so. There is nothing in this car. If you'll let me explain to it and not interrupt me, I mean, I'll explain everything in full detail for my body camera, for your video and everything else. The dog alerts on the odor of narcotics. What that simply states is that a previous time, there has been some sort of narcotic inside that vehicle ranging from marijuana, meth, heroin, or any other narcotics that he hits on, okay? Which is nine separate ones. If you want Officer Varnum to explain that to you, when he gets finished, he can explain every narcotic that his dog alerts on, okay? There has never, uh, there's nothing in this car unless somebody has planted something. This is freaking me out. Just because the dog hits doesn't mean there's something in the car. Okay, oh, you're saying, oh, okay. Been in the car. Oh, okay. Like party people, and it's not there now. So let me ask you. Everybody you pick up, do you physically search them and pat them no, down? No, sir. Okay. I could, can't imagine this sticking on me. They could have had a joint in their daggum pocket. Okay. And the odor. Do you have cloth seats or leather? Leather. Okay. Cloth is Y'all, please clear me. I've never, I've never been high on hard drugs in my life. Like okay, said, wait a minute. I'm talking over you. Goes. I know. I'm talking over you. What are you saying, sir? So exactly what I'm saying, somebody could have got in your vehicle with a freaking roach with marijuana, okay. laced with marijuana in it, and the odor okay. could still be in there. They okay. or you. I'm good. Smell. I'm feeling better now. Okay. So like I said, I've never been high on hard drugs slander. in my life, and no. Okay, y'all. This this is quite an experience, but I feel better now that you're saying that. I mean, I thought this was like going down. I am not happy. So, I don't like this, but I've never been high on hard drugs in my life. And we're not accusing you of that. Okay, far, right? but I mean, the car was like, you know, rented out are years you the only, ago. Are you the only one that drives it? I am now, but you know, it was rented out years ago. But I, what happened is the insurance went up so bad that we, we had three limos. We were in the limo business. And the insurance went up. They passed some kind of law where you had to have a million dollars per car because they look at it as like six people in the in the car at 100 200 grand a person in a wreck and they said a million dollars a car and we weren't making that much money with it so we sold two of them and just kept one Woo! i consider this a close call but no this is going to clear <laughs> okay well, but I mean, you're I'll... saying somebody might have got back there with with uh with some kind of drugs, but I don't do drugs. I'm not around people with drugs. So just a curious question. How many people did you just drop off at the bar or whatever over in Gaston? Uh Just, actually, they were supposed to have two back there, and it was, one guy drove a vehicle, and the other Hispanic, it was just one Hispanic guy, and he, he's a straight-up guy. He doesn't he doesn't smoke or do anything wrong. He doesn't, he, he drinks beer, and I don't drink or do anything. Well, prior to that, who, have you had anybody in the back of the car? It's been years, literally, other than family. So tonight was your first. Yeah, report. it was. You can call him. It's it's uh, Ojeda. It's uh, it's uh, um, Josue and Jasmine that have, have a club there. Okay. And I didn't drink. I just drank water. My next question: Where did? Is it a male, female, whatever? Where did they come from? It's a male, but he doesn't do anything. Yeah, but wrong. where did, where did you pick him up from? Hey, man, this is gonna clear. I the the Hispanics that I was with earlier they don't do drugs. So, but where did they come from? Where did you pick them up? From? Well, I mean, what it, I'm trying to explain it, to you. Where did they drove up to my place and I carried them back down here? But this is going to clear, y'all. So who's to say that they weren't around somebody that was smoking a little bit of weed? The there ain't no way. There ain't no way yeah, these people that I'm really, around really do drugs. People. No, these are these are straight up people. This is going to clear. Yeah, I really promise you, this will clear. Well? I mean, but no, they're they're family friends. No, they don't smoke or do anything wrong.
like a business? Yes. Okay. I was wondering, I didn't know. This will clear, but y'all have freaked me out. You're good, man. Okay. But look. I'm going to cut off the video because I feel no, comfortable. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Okay, keep it going. Keep it going, man. Okay. Listen, it alerts when my odor starts, okay? So that means odor. It could have happened three years yeah. ago. I mean, well, I don't know about that, but odor stays, you know, the odor, like marijuana, for example, it's a very strong odor, okay? It can stay in someone's clothes. It can stay okay. in someone's hair. It can stay in the interior, you know, and it stuff like that, okay? Okay. They could have literally, he, somebody could have sat down in that car and had the odor on their okay. clothing and it could have possibly somehow got on there, okay? Because you got to think, shit. it's got carpet in the back, like a lot, True. okay? In the back of it right there. Like the floor, the roof. Even the from years ago, because I, I mean. I don't know about from years okay. ago, but so, it just depends. There's a lot, it depends on a lot of stuff. Y'all okay? don't know what it means to me so, to clear me, because I swear to y'all, I don't break the law, and if something went down against me, it would be some kind of crazy shit that just wasn't supposed to happen. You're good, man. What so, but I'm, I'm going to cut it off, okay? That's no I'm good.